Musecasters, it is me, Ben. I'm in Sydney, Australia, and there's trouble in paradise. <laughs> no, not really. Uh, this trip has been quite the challenge for me. Last I talked to you guys, I had just gotten here. It was a beautiful day. It was sunny. I was so excited to be in Oz, and I'm still excited to be here. Don't get me wrong, but so much has happened in the last week, including... Are you ready? Bum, bum, bum. I left my camera in the taxi cab last night. Seriously, what's my problem? How? It's this camera. And you know what's funny is that I've been to Australia the last two years in a row. The first year, I left it in my bag on the way home and I had a layover in Fiji and it got stolen. Last year, I left it in Perth. Luckily, they were able to ship it over to me before I left, so I still got it. But this is the same camera that I lost. I don't know if I told you guys I found it, but I found it and now I lost it again. I'm an idiot, that camera's cursed. Anyway, um, yeah, so I had a ton of amazing footage to show you guys and now I have nothing to show you. So it's me, it's Ben. I'm just gonna tell you really quick that this trip's been really amazing. As soon as I left you guys on Friday, I ended up going straight into rehearsals, a friend of mine. I uh, was choreographing for an artist. Her name is Amelia Depore. I'll see if I can put a link in the sidebar. Wait, is it that side? I'm using my friend's computer and I don't, I've never done this. I usually use my camera, but I don't have it. So yeah, I'll put a link in the sidebar, whichever side it is. And you can check her out. She's really amazing. We did this great show with her for about 30 people at the Mardi Gras festival which there were about 20,000 people they just weren't in the area that we were at so a little bit of a bust but we still got through it it was a great performance and she's amazing it was great to perform with her so spent the next couple days chilling and seriously in the last two days it has just gone off like I tried to organize a couple classes and nothing like a little last minute teachy teachy I ended up flying to Melbourne yesterday on a 6 a.m. flight taught two classes had dinner with my friend down there got a 6 a.m. flight back this morning because it's Friday here I know it's confusing and now um, I ended up teaching three classes today and it looks like I'm flying to Perth next week which is about four hours away so lots of good things have come up it's just been crazy and everything about it has been so hectic like so last minute trying to book flights trying to organize everything and it's all worked out of course because it always does but man a little bit of stress around here and I'm just I'm sorry I don't have that footage to show you I'm really a little piece of me is dying inside that I don't have uh, pictures of all kinds of cool stuff and of me teaching because I know how much you guys love seeing that but that's it in a nutshell. I'm still here. I'll probably be here through next week. I'm sorry that this is late. Again, I was running around. I didn't have my camera. I got home late. I mean, it's it's even a day later here and it's still late, so I'm sorry. But thank you guys so much for watching. I, I'm, I'm uh, coming to you live from Sydney, Australia. It's kind of cool being around the world and doing this Musecast blog, this international Musecast blog. And yes, Eric and Vic, it is Aussie some. You guys are total dorks, but I love ya. Peace and love to everybody out there. I will see you next week, hopefully with something even more exciting.